hello friends welcome again and this is my new project billing system online billing system and i have developed this project in java spring boot and angular and mysql database so this is a micro service based application where we have developed a micro service in spring boot tools using spring boot api right and the version for the jdk i'm using the jdk 1.8 and for front-end development i have used angular right angular version is 7 we are using but you can update it also right so uh, the version of the mysql i'm using the mysql version 5.6 and uh, for id we are using sts for uh, spring boot development and uh, visual studio code for angular development right so if you have different id then you can try but we are using this id for developing these applications right so we are using and serve command uh, for running the angular application and we are running uh, spring boot tools it using the sorry spring boot application using the sts id right so these all technology stacks we have used for developing this project right except it this is a web-based application so we have designed all of the things using html and css right so these are the technology stacks which we have used for developing this project right so let's start with the functionality go through that what are the functionalities available inside this project what features it contains right so once you run this project you will get this login page and this is an admin driven application there is no customer login there is no customer operations only admin operations are available here right it, it is suitable for the shops not for the customer driven applications right so the user id is amit at the rate gmail document password is test once you log in inside the system you will get this dashboard right from here you can perform certain operations right so here you can see start sales order report product report add product company report so these all are the cred applications right so let me go through one by one so once you click on the start sales you will get this uh, form here you need to enter the customer name and customer mobile number right customer name suppose i am using jack mark and the mobile number you can enter anything once you click on the start cell you will get this sales dashboard here you can see your order has been created right on the name of jack Marrow. this is a date and customer mobile number this drop down will contain all of the products which is available in the system right you will select the product from here and after that you, you will enter the quantity once you click on the add item then you will get this item here right you can see the price per unit to how many so everything is calculating automatically right so you can see so i am adding three so this one chili sauce and i am adding one only right so you can see all the things are calculating automatically right right so if you want to delete any item just click the delete button and that item will be deleted from the cart right once you click on the save sales then the whole information of this page will be saved inside the database and you can access it later also right so once you click on the save sales you can see the information has been saved and total amount has been calculated this is a order number each and every information is available here right so this is a sales flow right this is the order report all of the order which you have made will be displayed here right you can see this is your last order and once you click this icon then you will be able to see details of that order right so this is the order report this is a product report from where you will be able to see all of the product which you have added right and you can edit and update so this is a fully product application from where you can perform create read, update and delete operations on the product right you can see edit and once you click on the submit then that product will be saved updated in the database this is the add product from here you can add the product right all the forms are blank field validated right once you click on the submit then you will not be able to submit without entering all values in all of the fields this is a company report all of the company which is available in the database will be displayed here right you can add any number of company inside the database from the add company section so this is the credit application of the company same this is a category report from here you can perform cred application on the category right you can see this all the categories and once you click on the add category you can add any number of category from this page 
this is a logout and once you click on the logout your session will be destroyed and you will not be able to access the internal pages without login right so let me show you i am clicking on logout you can see your session has been destroyed and you have re redirected to the login page once you log in then you will get this search dashboard right so these all functionalities we have developed inside this project online billing system and as i told you earlier this is a java spring boot angular based web application and this is a micro based service system right and for id we are using sts and the visual studio code so if you need more functionality in this project just put it into the comment we will incorporate the changes we will make this project more better and better according to the requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching video thank you very much